Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Tigers. I'm Lauren. And I'm Kaylee. Today is Wednesday, February 17th, and it is a freshman teacher collaboration day, so please plan ahead. Let's start off with the next stop on the Black History Month Hollow Grounds Tour. Tuskegee, Alabama is the site of current day Tuskegee University, a private historically black university and national historic site. It was established in 1881 by Booker T. Washington as the Tuskegee Institution as a place of higher education serving the black community. There, the well-known George Washington Carver was the head of the Agricultural Department for 47 years and led advancements in that area. The university also led the way in African American aviation as the home of the Tuskegee Airmen, a group of black military pilots. Tomorrow, you'll be hearing about Maggie L. Walker. Let's head into the announcements. Ho-Chunk students, this one is for you. Everyone is welcome to the third annual Ho-Chunk Storytelling event tonight from 5.30 to 8.30 p.m. at the District 1 Community Center. A meal will be served for you. That's tonight, tonight, from 5.30 until 8.30 at the District 1 Community Center. Here's one for the football players. There will be a football academic behavior meeting today during Focus in the Commons. Check in with Ms. Smith. Today, Commons, be there or be square. Have you heard about the Cultural Heritage Artwork Competition? Beer of High School will be holding a Cultural Heritage Artwork Competition. Any student from any cultural background is welcome and encouraged to participate. Students will have one month to complete their entry and may use any variety of art to present. If you are interested in participating and were not able to attend last week's meeting, another informational meeting will be held in the Commons during Focus today. You can also contact Ms. Snipe or Ms. Schick for more details. Now, FFA. FFA Week Planning Committee will be meeting before school Thursday and Friday this week. Meetings will be at 7 a.m. in the Ag Room. Got that? FFA Planning Committee? Mark your calendars for Tuesday, March 3rd. You won't want to miss this event, the first ever Mr. Black River Falls pageant. You will see some of your male peers compete for the title of Mr. BRF. They will compete and be judged on fashion of their choice, talent, and formal attire and interview. That's Thursday, March 3rd at 6.30 at the Lunda Theater. Here's another exciting announcement. Are you interested in learning about foods from different parts of the world and traveling to London, Paris, Italy in the summer of 2017? There will be a parent meeting on Tuesday, March 15th at 7.30 for those interested in this fantastic opportunity. Stay tuned for more details. And last but not least, Tech Ed Trivia. Yesterday's Tech Ed Week Trivia question was... What is it called when you coordinate large numbers of robots to interact with each other and a collective behavior emerges? Answer, Swarm Robotics. Check out the email from Mr. Cassidy to see a video of over 1,000 working together. Now for today's trivia question. What accounts for 85% of exports from Wisconsin? A, forest products. B, meat production products, sorry. C, dairy products. D, manufactured goods. If you know the answer, reply to the email Mr. Cassidy sent this morning. That's it. We're going to wrap things up with a question from Zach Zilmer. What is your favorite lunch menu item? Have a great day, Tigers. My favorite lunch is stromboli. Stromboli. 
I gotta say, my favorite thing to eat is stromboli. Stromboli. Popcorn chicken and then the pretzel and cheese. Probably just the subs. Because I can dip my chicken in my cheese. Yeah, it's simple. Tastes good. Good combination of meat, cheese, and the lettuce. The cheesy goodness mixed with the hot ham and the delicious bread on top, just delicious. Because it's greasy and cheesy and delicious. It's real food. It's uh, real meat, well processed real meat. Uh, and the bread's really good. And the greasy cheese tastes really good. And that's why it's my favorite meal.